All right, we'll make up a bottle of fungal moonshine. Uh, don't worry about boiling it. Uh, I'm going to make up three empty water cans. I think. Yeah, I can make. Yeah. To fill with more dirty water. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Frost Plus Fallout 4. We're in a bit of trouble here at the present moment. Um, I can't use a fungal purge because I haven't got enough health. So I really need rat away. I need to find some rat away. And I've got to find some food. And I need water filters. So I'm going to try and the guy here, oh god. The guy here told me about um, uh, a ration center, ration stockpile around here. And I might be able to get some food out of, so I'm going to go, my main aim is to go there. And hopefully they might have some water filters there. Because I really need some water filters. Because as you can see, most of that uh, radiation poisoning has happened from me drinking water. Unfiltered water. So, um... Less delay, we shall be off. Uh, this is uh, fairly late the next day, probably about, um, let's see now, uh, the flame arrived, uh, probably about 2.30, because um, I only went to sleep at about 5.30 in the morning, and had about 8 hours sleep, so we'll continue on. And I as I said, I really need uh, food. And right away, right away is my most uh, uh, important find, or well, a couple of them. <laughs> but then I have to drink water, water filters, and right away is uh, what I really need. Oh look, there's ghouls. Oh Jesus, they must be feasting on those bodies. Oh shit, they're going to be chasing me. Um, I'll just do the bolt here. Uh, uh, who says smoking <laughs> shortens your breath? Ah. <laughs> uh, I'm still not 100% after uh, being washed up on that shore. I took a bit of a beating in the water. My head's still not together. It's lucky I've still got any memory left. I had a good whack. It had a good whack. Um, got to jump ship. There we go. They're going to have me. Oh, there's one big one here. Um, ooh. Oof, use that, use up. I died about a hundred there, and I used up most of it on these guys. I'll take your dollar, dollar bundle, <laughs> bundle of dollar bills. <laughs> I'm glad I had fire for him. I'll take your lead out of your pencil. <laughs> okay, well we're gonna, well we might as well go and have a look and see what the whose brains are feasting on. Too bad it didn't have an eagle back at uh, the castle or else I got to take all these bodies back down there and chomped them all up. Uh, but, oh no, I couldn't, couldn't because I haven't got, um, I'll take that because I don't know how to make an engine. <laughs> Mercy flare, no, I don't need that. I probably should have taken it, but I'm really low on space, I can't. Oh, it would have been nice if someone would have stuck something on the fire again. Oh, I ate most of that when I had that fungal purge the other night. I was going to have one last night, but I just haven't got... I've got I'm sitting on 
about 49 health and that's not enough for me to have a fungal purge um i mean that's what i mean i'm in a dire straits now oh look at it. i feel horrible i've got lethargy and parasites i'm hungry and i'm thirsty my thirst is killing me not so much the food i had, i've had pretty good food but it's my thirst because uh, as i say i haven't got uh, filtered water nah oh what's no one teddy bear nah ah oh, water Luckily the boots are the size of, what's in there, cow skull, okay. Luckily the boots I got in this Federation uniform, the guy had size 9 feet, which is good. Well, it's pretty, pretty well standard size feet. Mysterious note, drink fungal purge, bandage, nah, mysterious note, drink fungal purge, laser pistol, I'll take that. Ah, oh, smokestack gas mask. Blood pack, uh, no, um, uh, I need a, um, need, um, I just hang on to mine because mine's got, uh, um, microbe protection. This is what I like about this gas mask. I'll have a couple of drinks, there's 21 friggin' rads. Uh, I can't do anything about the food because I haven't really got any. The only food I have is a radiated food. And, um... I'll take that to, uh... This bin thing here. And, uh... I'll put it in there. And then we'll, um... Uh... No, I'm only hungry now. Oh, no, I'm still parched. <sighs> that wasn't enough water. Oof. You can tell it tastes the water's terrible. I probably should have read those notes. But I won't worry about it. Oh, Mass Bay University. I should probably go there and get educated. I'll do that probably on the way back or something. It didn't look much like much of a building. Let's see what's here. Nothing destroyed building. Uh, I don't know if I'll be coming back this way for a while. I've really got to. There's, a, there's someone up there. Yeah. Alright, I wonder if they're friendly. I don't think so. I'll get a mine ready. And, um. Alright, two. Hello? Here. Yeah. Uh, uh oh, he's not very friendly. Get that little fucker. Ah! He. Gone. <laughs> uh oh, they're not happy. They're not happy. Uh, 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 uh. uh. Alright. Okay. I am a rookie. Rookie here. They look like. Uh. Oh no, oh no, This lead pipe spiked is any better than my, um, my, oh god, uh, too bad I dropped my, I, I should have, um, I didn't handle that, I'll take those blood packs, see the blood packs are bugger all now, they used to, they used to, I'll uh, put a bandage on, they used to heal a lot, now they only heal 2%, which is bugger all. I'll take it. Uh, I'll separate you lot. I'll take you eight dollars. I don't need. I'd like to buy a gas mask. It's worth money, but um, I haven't got. I haven't really got the room. It's uh, three pound. And uh, no. Nah. All right. I'll just check. Uh, see. Let's see now. 
lead pipe 25 with medium thing and um, my torch is 15 plus 10 25 and 15 plus 10 so it's 25 virtually but they're on fire and this weighs a bit little 1.5 pound more so um, yeah I won't worry about it I'll keep with my torch the other cho I, since I want to take the flamer with me to um, I check the knuckles 19 and medium they're lighter but they're not as fast so if, if you would had a dagger I would have thought about it a uh, knife um, yeah uh, as I was saying um, since I want to use the flamer because my high rate count and uh, I probably might be coming up against ghouls um, I thought uh, six dollars nah. rugged grey shirt and combat boots well they're all right I think they got uh, it's got uh, heavy metal right arm is it what's my uh, right arm it's 9.15 but it weighs six pound that's seven three and weighs three 915 hmm 7 I probably should have uh, taken taken that light armor cuz at this present moment I really need protection from ballistic damage and that's medium armor that weighs twice as much uh I'll just Stay I stay as I am. Oh a bat. Uh I can't cheat drop the bat. I could have uh, I'd have to pick the bat up. Um alright, let's see, is the bat worth anything? Um uh, yellow bat forty seven slow and I get twenty five medium and they're on fire. Well, I probably should have, um, yeah, well, won't worry about it. Uh, while they're on fire, they, oops. Shit. I was, I was uh, distracted by looking ahead by seeing that can. I think that's a can of cram. And, um, God, I hope it's good cram. Oh, it's radiated. Christ. Oh, this fucking oh, shit. What's that cooking? A radiated dog. Oh, God. I hope they put two dints in it. Um. Oh, I'll take that. I need that. Because, um. I remember when I used to be in the services and we cooked. Or army. Uh. And we cooked, um. Canned food. We had uh, these little portable hexamine stoves, we used to call them hexi stoves. There's a sort of a stove which kept it, s you get a block of hexamine tablets and it fitted inside the stove, you know, the stove collapsed upon itself and it'd be probably be about 2.2 uh, centimetres tall and, um, oh, I don't know, uh, 4.2 four centimeters wide and the hexamine tablet it opened up to support stuff like it had type of teeth and your top it bent uh, and you could open it up and it'd stand on its end and you could have to you put your hexamine tablets in it and you and when you open it up the teeth on it supported whatever you want to cook like your, your coffee or something in your cups canteen um, a cups canteen was a aluminium cup that had a folding uh, handle that fitted on the bottom of your canteen snugly so it was easy to pack you put your water canteen inside and I'll take this hub flower and um, yeah well you'd put a half a hexi block in or something like that and uh, you'd light it up and then um, what you had to do with your canned food was get the uh, heel, um, get it and bang it twice on the heel of your boot, make two different 
sets of dents in the side of the can and then you'd stick the can on uh, the fire and let it cook and uh, when the first dent blew out came you hear this pop and then when the first dent blew uh, popped out you'd take the can straight off the fire and if you're going to make a cup of coffee or something like that you keep the fire going and you put your water in your cups canteen and uh, you put it on the fire and you waited for um, about a minute or so for it to cool down and then you've got your little opener thing oh you've got your bush hat which was the hat you wore on your head um, and then you grab your uh, uh, can which is really hot and then you put your uh, opener thing in it oh there's a relay tower and then uh, you punch at the can and make sure you're not facing towards it because it's squirted out under pressure of some liquid and then you'd open the can up the reason why you put two dents in was um, that when the first one popped you knew it was ready when the second one popped it was usually about to blow <laughs> so you always put two dents in your can and if a can blew it'd blow crap all over the place and you could be injured from burnt food. I get my um oh shit here we go, there's rats. Well, there's always something around these things. Um here we go. Oh shit. Oh, oh. Christ. Oh. 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 Come on, rat. Oh. Oh. Jesus. God. Take meat out of you. I think I burnt this one. Burnt. Or a burnt bit or whatever. Um, yeah, and if your can blew up, you'd be uh, charged for um, type of uh, unauthorised dis discharge. I'll take the meat out of this rat. So it's um, imperative. Because it gave away your position, like, oh god, I look horrible. It gave away your position, yeah, because it was a bit of an explosion and dangerous. <laughs> yeah, so you'd get charged. So the whole thing was that it is for your own benefit to put two dents. I have some water in your can of um, food. So uh, that's uh, my lesson on eating army food out in the field. <laughs> So, and you've got to learn how to cook uh, quick and I'll have a look around here. Uh, there's only traffic cones. Uh, a couple of containers. You wonder where these containers come from. How could they have, might have been picked up by the blast and ended up here. Uh, oh, look, here's another rat. You dirty rat. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, come here, rat. God, you can run faster than me. Killing me, this rat. I'm not handling these rats too well. Problem is, um, <laughs> I'm still used to being in uh, playing the other other player, Zach, because um, if he had better armor, I could afford to be um, <laughs> a bit slack with my uh, defense. I'll put a bandage on. Ah, oh God, this is not working out well. I'm really sick. I'm just about dying. I've got to go and as I say, I've got to. Um, I'm going to lengthen this, start this tower up. Yeah, I really have to um, prioritise my uh, energy, the way I spend my time. Try to get a good food supply and secure water supply, clean water supply, which there is none around here, maybe in you know, a vault but I'm not strong enough I've, I've got enough strength to um, take on a vault ammunition or anything or any decent armoured clothes um, alright I think this will probably be the end, here we go <coughs> <coughs> that's it Haha, <laughs> dirty rat. Oh, look now, I'm overweight. Oh, I've got to get rid of something. I'll get rid of this silver pocket watch. Oh, shit. Nice extended. 
Alright, well, call this an episode. Um, we're in a pretty bad state at the present moment. Got a lot of rads. Not much health. Might have to go back to that encampment and have a sleep. Um, but we're not, don't seem to be too far away from uh, <coughs> uh, the rationing stockpile. I'll, once I use that, um, get that flamer and use up all the fuel, I'll dump the flamer and they'll give me a lot more um, space to uh, pick up rations. I've used up a lot of fuel on those g early ghouls. Um, I suspect there'll be ghouls in here, so I'm in there, or so I'll you try and use the flamer fuel up and try and stay away from the ghouls and stuff. Keep my distance, <coughs> but my weapons are pretty well shit at the present moment. Um, alright, well, nothing too much happened in here, a little bit of action. Okay, thank you very much for watching, hope you enjoyed it, and I'd love to catch us all back next time. See you later.